Amidst significant changes within the Danish royal family, King Frederick and his consort have made the decision to part ways. Queen Mary will no longer reside at the Eland Borge Palace, marking the end of an era for the royal couple. The past year has been particularly challenging for King Frederick, compounded by his mother, the 84-year-old Queen Margaret, surprising everyone with her abdication announcement during the traditional New Year speech. The beloved Queen promptly stepped down on January 14, paving the way for King Frederick to ascend to the throne and take on the mantle of leadership for their proud nation. Before we proceed, please like this video and subscribe to our channel. The transition to kingship brought about profound changes for King Frederick and Queen Mary. Suddenly thrust into the role of head of state, King Frederick found himself shouldering the weight of responsibility for the country. The dynamics shifted as he no longer had the buffer of being a crown prince, decisions now rested squarely on his shoulders. While he could still seek counsel from his esteemed mother, the ultimate actions and consequences were his to bear, a stark realization of the solitude intertwined with royal duties. Looking ahead, King Frederick and Queen Mary are poised for the next chapter as a royal couple. They have decided to bid farewell to the iconic Mayan Borge Palace in Copenhagen, a historic edifice spanning 5,000 square meters across three floors. The palace, with its rich heritage and significance, has been a central hub for the royal family. However, the couple is preparing to move to the exquisite Chancellery House within Fredensborg Palace, signaling a shift towards a new abode that promises a blend of tradition and modernity. The relocation underscores a significant adjustment that necessitates security enhancements around Fredensborg Palace. The move, scheduled for May 2, has garnered attention, especially in light of a recent incident where a mentally ill individual gained an authorized access to Christian Borg Palace during Crown Prince Christian's 18th birthday celebrations. This breach highlighted the importance of reinforced security protocols to safeguard royal residences and events. In anticipation of their move to Fredensborg Palace for the European summer, Queen Mary shared a heartfelt video capturing the family's excitement.